what's up, YouTube? What's up, very cool gang? Listen, this is the deal. This is low-key covert. We're gonna bring you the inside of the DeWalt factory store. I hope so, you guys are ready. Nick's gonna be man in the camera. I'm gonna play distraction and talk to the people inside, but we're gonna show you what it looks like yeah. inside the factory store and show you what you might be able to see. Yes, we are redemption. If what's you up? We're here. Yes. Yeah, we're at Disney World. We lost them. Whatever. We're gonna go inside now. I'll try to. Is a nice, it's a smaller, compactor system. I, I just, I'm already in the tough. I'm already in the tough system. I just, why move? Yeah. But I will tell you this much. If you look, like the organizers and all, 37, 33 for the double drawer. Okay. The, the cart's 50 bucks. The dolly's a little 124. It's not nearly as tough as the tough system cart. It's not bad. But not bad is right. 30 bucks. Deep box. 29.93 on the organizer. What do you think? Uh, yeah, you know. What's up, man? What's up, Kev? Look at me. I, I think that. The wheels aren't as, I mean, it's just not meant to be as, as tough as the tough system. But, is it a good system? Shit, yeah. I like it. The handle moves. Oh, back. okay, I see the handle moving with it. That's pretty interesting. That's a T stack, huh? Yeah, this is all T stack. So is the T stack? We're looking. Is, the is it okay? Sure. Thank you, is dear. The, is the T but stack? if we have any questions, we'll be bothering you soon. Don't worry. Right. <laughs> is the T stack cheaper than the tough system? Yeah, the T stack is definitely cheaper. Look at that though, that's, look how slick. Look, these are nice metal hinges. Look at me. That is pretty nice. Slides open. I think that's pretty slick. Then we got their cantilever box. I mean, you know, it's, that's okay. Yo, you can factory trade off. Look at all the old tools that are in there. Yo, you man. notice any? Healthy. There's a lot of team red in there. It's a graveyard. Metabo. What's up, Jake? So, are we back? They have the rack system. Workshop racking system, 113.33. Okay. And the good part is, if you come to the, and this is the factory store that I needed the replacement parts for the organizer. Mm -hmm. This is the factory store we ordered those parts for. Okay. Okay. So you can pick up the DS carrier brackets for the for the rolling for the rolling DS carrier. Those those arms you can get them for this carrier. That's pretty cool. It's pretty cool. I mean, what's up, Rox? Yo, <laughs> yo, you got you got the, the organizer right. It's a $39, $39 a depot. They have it here at $37.33. They have different assorted boxes and all. The tote at $28. I gotta tell you, the cart at $187.33, you know you can get it at the Wall store if you want it. Just saying. Look at the plate. It's a box. It's ridiculous. Everybody, yo, everybody asks where I get the, my countersink kit. I got my countersink kit that I use for my cabinetry installs. How much is it? Hey, guys. How you What's doing? Up? Up you? Ah, no, we're, we're just browsing around. Right is that okay? Yeah, yeah, I guess it's fine. Thank you, buddy. I was taking uh, people, some, some pics. So I was wondering people, what was going on. Yeah, people, yeah. People, a lot of people ask me where I, get, we, where I got my countersink kit. Mm -hmm. 
and this is actually the store. You can't find this in Depot, you can't find yeah, it anywhere. Yeah, that, you gotta come here. Yeah, but we, we were in for sure. Or in, in dust, or industrial supplies. You know, di oh, uh, different over, industrial over. supplies. No, I mean. Diamond has it. Well, diamond, yeah. yeah. Like that. I yeah. come here anyway for service, so of course I got it here. Uh, and I think you guys were running like half plus all. What's that? that? You guys were running like half plus all. No, no, no. Uh, well, we have a thing. If you get, if you pay paid repair, you have twenty five percent off. It was twenty five percent off. Yeah. Something like that. Right. But it only makes sense to get it. I mean, I like done. Mm -hmm. But we don't have all those questions like that. Yeah. The long boy. But I appreciate it. Don't be rude. <laughs> don't be rude. <laughs> no. Try not to be. No, no. I'll tell you what. Well, you get repairs from under what? Under what name? Under either company? Under VCG. VCG? Under VCG. Yeah, we got VCG, I think. Or. I think I, I might have this. Is there anything you guys so, want to see in particular? So the last thing we ordered was minuscule. It's a Mar photo. <laughs> yeah, right. I'm not doing that. I know you would like it, Redemption. Brush. Just look at that. Horse back in the back of the truck. Set. You want to see the rolling box, Copper? We got Tough System and T Stack. I know any other tools I'm playing coming up in the future. So what we'll do is, I personally like to get the, I like the camera. Oh, that's pretty cool. And we'll take, we'll take the, the boxes off, oh. and then put them in the trucks, and then pull in with the carrier. Right. So the, but the, then you secure the carrier in the van. Oh, yeah. Yeah, because see, they, they, these, these are so you go right to the wall of the truck. Yes. So that if you drive around, that's, you can that's, take your boxes off the cart and put them on right. the Right, so, so you put the cart there, then you have that, then you slide these off, and you have those on. And that's, that's great. So when you hit brakes or uh, whatever happens, they don't they're, slide. Yeah, they're crash tested. Same as they test the cars for holding power. So you got 150 pounds of each on each shelf of weight. But we that yeah. yeah. That's awesome. And that's made for that one, the tough system. So, yeah. Does T Stack have one too? Not for just the Just the tough system? Yeah, just the tough system. The, the, the tough system. The plastic, the clear plastic lid. Yeah. The, then break. See, we got. Well, I see that on we, YouTube. They turn around and take the Where's everybody at? Package deals. Let me see. I'm not sure.
That's true, Angel. What's up, guys? I'm reading your comments. Um, I, they probably have them in the back copper. 34. Um, they might Bronx. I'm not sure. I'll have to ask. Big one's three by two by two. Somewhere around there. Let me see. <laughs> I don't want to push my luck, you know what I mean? No, 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 Matt, we're... We're at um, we're at the DeWalt uh, factory store. I'm just talking. So, uh, uh, Sandy, I know you said you did some repairs. Oh yeah. Thank you. Oh, yeah. Hey, Sandy. Excuse me. Hey, Sandy. Yeah. Uh, what was that? Uh, this. This had a job you see. Oh, yeah. Speaking of this. Yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, I know, man. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to. Oh, the right angle. This is, this is clutch right here, the right angle. I'm going to ask him, Bronx. I don't know yet. All the good stuff's in the back, guys. Just taking a break. Redemption. Redemption, when I get the ability to live stream, I'm a high viewer, my monitor. Sorry, I can't give you guys. Go help Demolition Ranch. Yo, did you, are you coming from that, from their channel? I, we would love to go out there and help those guys. Yes, I am. Cool. Yeah, we want to help him. We need you to help spread the word. PJ Calliday, one. We need you to help spread the word. Flexvolt grinder. Do you guys have any experience with Flexvolt? Let me know. As soon as I read the comment, I came to the channel. Yo, thanks for coming over, PJ. That's awesome, man. We're glad to have you. 
We got a very cool gang over here. Welcome to the channel. N3 QDZ man says breaking hammers. Thanks, bud. I have to mute from your own live stream, lol. Oh, well. I got the flex volt nine amp hour batteries. Not flex. How much did it cost you, Redemption? How much did the battery cost? I gotta tell you, the FlexVolt tools look nice. And the XR. Redemption, does the FlexVolt work with the XR? So, this is like their rocket light. It is. It's like your rocket light. You don't have light. the ability to, you know, like I know there's Not the, three, the, 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 I know what you're you can't do about. that, but you'll see the way the thing, when this, you get a battery, you'll see the way it lights up. How much? Look here. Keep it looking. I'm trying, I'm trying. Yeah, this takes flex and twenty. Whatever, yeah, you can see there's room for the nine eight hour in there too. Nice. Oh, this thing is bright. The thought it's hard to yeah. This thing is bright. Three thousand? Is that the same? Three thousand? Is that the same as their high one? Yes. Their low one, which I think the price is about the same as their low one is like one thousand. Okay. It is. No charge. Just a one. It's backwards compatible and work with their 20 volt. I play games. What's up, man? Glad you're here. Do the flex volt work with the XR? Are they like interchangeable? Yes. Any 20 volt. Any 20 volt? 20 volt backwards compatible. Okay. So there might be like one or two tools in there, you know, that you can't use a flexible battery. Like that radio, for example, the, the radio is just, that, radio that right particular radio is up here, you can't see it. Okay. Okay. radio. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. So, so okay. flat and yes. small. So that doesn't fit in that. There might be like one or two other, I think. Yeah, yeah. Nothing major, you know. Okay. Mostly everything, every 20 volt product can accept a flexible. This is technically a 20 volt product. Flexible battery can make no problem. Do you guys? Additional run time. Okay. Do you guys make a jackhammer at all? Or well, some yes. type of demolition tool? Yeah, I mean, it depends on what you're talking about. Uh, cordless, um, the biggest hammer we're gonna get into is the Engine 916 solid bit, okay. which has a chip mode. We okay. also do have a, um, you know, a, a large breaker hammer okay. that's corded. Yeah. Um, I suppose if you wanted to, you could plug it into our, the power source. We have a, you know, a four battery power source. Yeah, the inverter. The, uh, the inverter. Yeah. Oh, power with the, where it charges? Yeah, the, the charge station and the inverter. Yeah, yeah okay. Station. I so saw it. It looks cool. Four batteries, and then you can run, you know, corded products off of it. Um, so, that can be cordless in that regard, but yeah, okay. we have, I mean, I think we have one here too if you wanted to see it. But we have big breakers that take that, take that bit, the hex bit. So you can throw this type of steel into that large hammer. Okay. The large breaker. Okay. The other the other one's SDS Max. It just depends on what you want to do. SDS okay. Max breaker with with you know hole pointer chipping or or flat you know, chisel, chiseling scales. They all fit. Actually, I'm sorry. These ones fit on him uh, in this one. You can see a side way. SDS Max. You know ground rod drivers or okay. any of these working. <coughs> Large, you know, engine nine sixteenths. That's cordless. We have corded versions of it as well too. But okay. what are you looking to do? Um, I got a buddy of mine who's yeah, trying so to break up, like said, just break up some rock. So yeah, I would, you're probably better off in that big. If it's a lot, if it's a, if it's a big area. Yeah. I would say you're probably better off going with the big breaker. Okay. It's not cheap. Um, yeah, you do have. I mean, there's a lot of SDS Max. Most is not safe. And the SDS is the uh, the cordless, right? It can be. We have cordless and corded. Okay. And SDS max. But is it just twenty volt? Twenty volt max it goes uh, up no, to. No, that's or? actually a sixty volt. Box. Sixty volt. So that one you would have to use a sixty volt battery, and it's not. A, it's not a. You can't use a twenty volt battery in a sixty volt product. Yeah. It's like that syrup saw or a grinder or a reseal saw. It's sixty volt. Do you, you guys have flexible here? 
Yeah, I mean, there's some here. I don't know what he's got in stock, but... Mostly batteries. You know, batteries. I mean, there, there's... Do there's they have, like, shop. um... Do you guys have any package deals that you're offering right now? I think there's, like, one... Um, but you always have the bare tool pricing. So, like, you're gonna take a combo kit and then throw a couple bare tool, you know, bare tools in it. It's pretty close to what you would get if you just bought a combo kit that we have out there, like a five tool, yeah. six tool combo kit. Um, every once in a while, I see one of those get priced aggressively, but for the most part, if you're taking bare tools and adding them to a combo, usually it's pretty good. Okay. You know, only maybe a couple dollars from okay. a big combo kit. Yeah. Um, yeah, so. Anything else? Any other deals you got going on right now? Uh, definitely the trade up. Definitely one. I mean, you could take an old 18 volt product. He's got a couple different flyers. Yeah, I mean, the way we, the way we work here, you know. Does it, can it be DeWalt too? Yes. Or, it can. Competitive product and DeWalt. So I have an old DeWalt 20 volt max drill driver. It's not a hammer, but it's just, it's just a drill depends driver. On the, it depends on what it is. You have to look. They, got like a, they have like a list of all acceptable products. Because te okay. technically the idea is to get you on 20 volt. Okay. So if you're going from 20 volt to 20 volt, right? He's got an older 20 volt drill. Yeah, there's no the max. 20 to 20, though, I think. Yeah, there's okay. no 20 to I like 20, it. But, um, it still works. Like good. I was saying, if you guys been in the wall for a while, you might have some, some stuff buried, 18s, that are buried. That's the deep price. Especially if you want to get the... Uh, so how does... What are you trade up? What are you trading up to so the 20 volt, right? So like this is, this is the, this is a regular competitive trade-off. So if you got any brand like that, we would give you a, a nice price on brand new. Okay. Now a distributor always gets credit somewhere, somehow. So like if you said you normally buy from Diamond, you come in here, you buy, you pay us, we give Diamond a kickback at the end of the month, at the end of the quarter. So we always go to a distributor. Um, and that's all the time for competitive. Now for uh, like a loyalty program on the 18s, Again, because we have so many 18s out there, just to keep those people, and they've been, you know, our customer for 10 years, 20, yeah. just to keep them in the flow, we're giving them under, under wholesale price for That's great. 20 volt. That's so great. We'll take your 18 and say, because some people say, man, but it's still good, or I got it's 10 It's still batteries, working I got great. 20 batteries. Yeah. You're so you know, invested in the 18 I'm so invested, in, but, but then, but they want to change a lot of tools, so we say, you know what? We'll give you such a low price on it. If you're going to buy batteries or you're going to get it repaired, we're kind of talking ourselves out of repair, which is our main function here. But <laughs> because we're really giving it to you, it makes no sense to repair a lot of these tools because we're giving you a whole kit. You're going to get batteries, everything like that. Yeah. Right. So you can get the highest end 20 volt for like a $175 kit, which you buy, let's say, a diamond for 300 right? Yeah. So you're going to get it for like 175 so that's on the point of the kit. And then the batteries, we do the same thing. So you say, well, you know, I got 10 batteries. Yeah, all these batteries. You know, so you're going to get a real deep deal on the new batteries. Okay, so there's a, we call that the repair trade kit. And then, um, so we have that. And, and But now, we just rolled out, came out, haven't even announced it to the team. We got, we got to roll that out. If there's a right opportunity for competitors to have also that super deep deal. You know, we won't go for one or two, but you know, you have 10, 15 tools. We're gonna give you the super deal. So, and you can literally, you can bring in Milwaukee stuff, any type yeah. of stuff. Yeah, yeah. Does, stuff. it could be working or not working. Like some guys say, like, really? They, 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 they say they it's might hit my hammer. Yeah, you could have tried to fix it in the spare time if you had <laughs> that, right? And you said, let me try to fix it. You could put it all back together and you bring it in a body bag. I still take it for a trade. Wow. Yeah. No, that's cool. awesome. So, like, if you send it awesome. out, if you send it out, let's say you send it out, you're over there by Milwaukee, you took up a hammer, and they tell you, look, that much. You say, geez, I have it already. It's giving me my money's worth. I don't think I want to invest it in there. If you bring that hammer in here, you, you get a discount on it. That's pretty cool. That is awesome. That's so, great deal. So, yeah, so, all of these are like, you know, we, we really love to fill up with red. Either Hilti or Milwaukee. Yeah. <laughs> that's the first thing you say is all red. Get the red out. You know, that's the thing. We'll do that on blades, too. If you have the other red uh, blades, if you have Diablo blades, which are very popular up there. Oh, uh, yeah, the saw blades. blades. Yeah. Yeah. We got, uh, we got uh, like, four or five different blades. We'll give you 50% off. Quite frankly, the precision line. That's awesome. Best line. Yeah. Best line. Right. So, yeah, sure. so that's how we want to try it. Because a lot of people are trying to do you know, the video. Diablo is out there. You've done a good job. What's up, Greg? So we say, Justin. Hey, give us an, an old Diablo that's, you know, I'll give you my old. It is okay. indeed heaven on earth. We'll give you 50% on the, uh, on the my, my, my main motor saw. Mm -hmm. That's my That's old 12 inch. Right. The guys, oh, can I make a quick cut? Nah, nah. It's a hundred dollar <laughs> precision blade. You ain't making it. You know what I mean? Go cut that somewhere else. Yeah. So. 
That's you, pretty awesome. You ready, kid? Yeah. Listen. All right, Paul. I appreciate it. Thank you very much. I'm going to bother you. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. All right. Focus I'm Nick. Nice to meet you, Jeff. Thanks. Take Carlos. it easy. Thanks Enjoy the pics, man. Yeah, How's thank you. Let us know if we can help you. Oh, we will. If you got a car, let me know. Definitely will. All right. Thank you, guys. Right. Let me go check. Yo, those dudes were a lot nicer than him. I know. I'm still going. The stream's still going. Yo. So, so, did you did you get all that about the trade up and all? I think I got it all. I mean, that that's pretty awesome. That's an awesome deal. I mean, that's a great. Matt's like, wow, never saw that before. That is. I that thought is, it was pretty cool. That is awesome. I'm gonna sign this off. What do you think? You want to say you want to say goodbye? Bringing you off limits down low. Peace out, guys. Thanks for being here. Sorry I couldn't talk more. Um, thanks for jumping over from other streams. Greg, Redemption, I want to thank you for moderating. Matt, glad to see you. Uh, who else am I forgetting? TiVo Man, Greg, The Thin Blue Line, Justin Carter, 187 ICU. Thank you, guys. PJ Calladay, thanks for jumping over. And uh, I guess I'll, I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.